gonna ooh, I'm not gonna lie I look good today hello so today is the first day of law school my you guys can't see but my eyebrows I don't know why they look so bushy and so different like obviously they look different but they look especially different today besides the point today is the first day of law school for me your girl and listen let me tell you guys something I I'm nervous but I'm not nervous because I prepared myself there you go you gotta stay prepared but um maybe I'm gonna show you guys where I'm living right now we got a whole different setup um it's a whole mess but you know it is what it is at this point i'm still trying to get everything settled in there's certain places that i'm not touching because i saw a spider so i'm not doing that until you know i work up the courage to do it because it's just me myself and i in this hoe so you know if if i'm not gonna get it who else is gonna get it um yeah overall i just wanted to pop in and just speak because if y'all saw my last video i got into law school if you haven't seen it go over there and watch it it's like i got into law school with a 2.7 undergraduate gpa bitch yes sir that was me and on top of that i also got a scholarship bitch because guess what well hold on it, it sounds like i'm bragging i'm not bragging but i'm just so happy because i really did pay my mother fucking dues like son anyways um this is just gonna be a little I don't even know what the fuck this is gonna be I, this may be a montage like a collection of the first week of law school this may be a first day this is the first time i'm picking up a camera so i don't know what the hell this is about to be but i guess i'll let you guys know how everything goes and yeah i'll talk to you guys later <laughs> classes is done and over with i had to wear a mask so um basically because the light didn't do anything basically i had to wear a mask they changed the rule right they changed the rule because of the variant and so um basically that's just what it's kind of been like right so now we have to wear a mask as opposed to before we didn't but i just wanted to show you guys my school at night and there are the cops but it's okay it don't matter right like i just want to show you guys my school at night um the campus is very beautiful let me just show you guys real quick and there it is right there there's the school in the middle that's the law center oh that lie bitch <laughs> that's the parking deck that's the school right there in the middle with the columns the tree is semi in the way but i just wanted to you know show you guys what i'd be doing let's back out this bitch okay so laying down didn't work obviously but basically i don't want to show you guys my room because i want to give you a not a tour but how i fashioned up my studio for law school etc right so um everything is still i moved in last thursday and we just brought in the furniture yesterday so everything is still kind of like random like let me show you that can y'all see my hair products are on the floor <laughs> random so um um today class if it didn't feel as intense as what i thought it was going to be it really wasn't that deep like um our professor was yeah he was cold calling and um he didn't cold call on me because i raised my hand a lot so that's probably why he didn't call on me but also i feel like maybe even that wasn't um the reason why just because well maybe today that was the reason why because he's trying to get to know everybody and talk to everybody but in general i don't know if that would be a reason not to call on me because i don't know but um you know it's my first date so <laughs> I, I guess i'll just learn but um it's nighttime now I got a lot to do. Um, so this is the end of day one. Tomorrow, I don't have any classes. So tomorrow is a reading day. I'm going to read for, um, what am I gonna read for? I have a lot to read for. Tell me why, so contracts, contracts and torts was today, right? Torts was the class where my professor was like, oh, I'm going to cold call contracts he was like i don't like the melodrama i don't like that whole dramatic shit like relax i'm not gonna cold call but y'all better be talking basically and so he um was just talking at us a lot which our mentors told us that he would do 
And um, what happened? He he was very fun to listen to. He was a lot more, um, I don't want to say he was more into the subject than the other guy. I would just say that he was more, um, I guess, he projected his voice more. Let's just say that because just because one projects their voice and the other doesn't doesn't mean one is less interested. So um, all, all of the discussions for like each of them were hella interesting and um so you know i raised my hand today to ask some questions i even got an answer wrong so that's okay you know i don't want to say wrong but it was just like um well no it was wrong but <laughs> it wasn't that big of a deal like i thought about it for a minute and i was like damn why am i the first one to get something wrong and then i was like wait i'm not the first one to get something wrong and Two, it doesn't even matter because you're not going to be right all the time. I don't know. I just really enjoyed today. Contracts is interesting. That reading was difficult. Tell me, that's why I brought this up. Tell me why he was like, oh, um, you know, read until, because he doesn't have a schedule of what he wants us to read. He's like, we're not going to skip around the book. The test, the final is between pages, um, chapters one through four. He said, we're going to go to page 101 and do the question 2-1. And then, you know, class was ended and so he was just talking to other people and I went to the girl and I was like, did he see, did he say read to page 101? And she was like, yeah. I was like, we're at page 35. <laughs> um, you sure? She was like, yeah. I was like, all right, okay, no, all right. Meanwhile, inside I'm like, yo, you know we got other shit to do. They were not kidding. He did not wait. He didn't try to give us a grace period. He said, law school is about reading, so read. <laughs> and that's just what we're going to have to do. So maybe the rest of this, not the rest of this video, but uh, oh, I'm not trying to show you guys too much. But um, maybe the next clip that you'll see is a montage of me reading. This is the end of day one. It was a success. <laughs> So you guys are catching me in one of my crazy moments, right? Like I'm half doing a braid out, half got my bun up here, but you know, it is what it is, right? Like I want to keep it real and um, I want to be able to film however I can and if this is the best way that I can film it because I just realized that I didn't give you an end of my day three. So end of day three, right? Like I was talking to my sister about this because um, I felt like I wasn't prepared and I didn't like that and the fucking thing in the bathroom is so loud but I feel like I wasn't prepared and she was just like stop being so hard on yourself so today in class um yeah we were talking about an assignment that's due on Sunday today is Wednesday and I was kind of upset because I was like damn I didn't remember that we had this assignment like 
so this is what kind of happened we had orientation last saturday and on that saturday we went with our um, legal skills professor but i didn't know that we were meeting with her during orientation like i just thought um because the emails that she kept sending us like a bunch of emails and so like she um there was some of them where she was like disregard or one of them and so i just didn't pay attention to her emails because our class was on wednesday and i intended on reading it later like this was last week way before saturday i intended on reading them later turns out i didn't really read them as much as i wanted to or as in depth because i was moving like i was moving in here whatever and I don't want to like give myself an excuse, but also I'm trying not to be hard on myself. Um, there has just been a lot going on. So I overlooked a couple parts where one, she was actually our professor that we were meeting on Saturday. So in that class, I was taking notes, but not really because I was like, it's orientation. Why am I taking notes? And um, and then from a plethora of, of professors, we've been giving given um, ways to brief a case saying that it's not all just like one type of thing you know like they were like basically you figure out your niche so today in class she was like let's talk about the assignment that's due on sunday today's wednesday so i was like we have an assignment or what what's this case we're talking about larceny i was like what are we talking about so people are pulling out the sheet that she gave us on saturday and i was like um you know like halfway through the saturday meeting well, not even halfway, like 10 minutes in, I was like, oh, this is our professor. Coming in on Wednesday, I knew what she looked like and stuff like that. I was like, I knew who she is. And um, the stuff that she gave us, I didn't bring because I couldn't find my stupid folder, my orientation folder for a minute. I'm so upset. I was so upset about that because I was like, Ugh. I feel so dumb because I wasn't prepared. I didn't know what we were talking about. In all of my other classes, I knew what we were talking about because I prepared myself. I try to make myself as prepared as possible because I don't like being ignorant in certain situations. And today I just felt ignorant. So um, my sister was like, why don't you pretend that this is your first time going through law school and this is your first time ever having law professors, whatever it is she said, right? And she was like, like you're, this is the first time that you've ever been assigned anything from a law professor. Why don't you pre pretend that that's what's going on? And I was like, <laughs> so that's just basically what i'm gonna have to do is just like stop being so hard on myself yo you guys have never seen me like this ever before i look hit but that's okay right you know it's it is what it is it's real my parts ain't never straight it is what it is <laughs> It's big button right now. I just ordered this. If I'm being honest, this is mainly everything that I've been doing so far. This whole week has been nothing but reading, reading for next week's class, and trying to get everything settled. So in these little clips, you'll see that I'm making some epis. You'll see that I'm, you know, trying to get my life in order so that way I can actually like focus on the very one thing that I came here to do, which is study. There's a meeting in my bed. My bed. See, as you guys can see with the stupid thing going off in the back, I'm making some epies. Hello, everybody. I've decided to close out this vlog um, in the library because where else would be a better place to um, close it out? I've been studying for a little minute now. I think I got here a little bit after 530 because I know I left the house at 530 and I'm only like 10, 15 minutes away. But um, so I wanted to close out this vlog giving something of a little bit of a 
um, I don't know what you would call it, but basically what I'm learning about myself is that I need to give myself the opportunity to take a break. I need to give myself, um, I need to be honest with myself for one. So something that takes 20 pages to read or some, or a 20 page read is what I'm trying to say takes me, what time is it? 9.47, roughly three hours to read and understand. So not just read it, but actually comprehend what's going on a little over three hours. Because, and I say that because I took breaks too. So I know, I know nine minus five equals four. I'm just saying, <laughs> like I took a little bit of a couple breaks. But I wanted to close out this vlog and to let you guys know, be honest with yourself, you know, don't, um, well, push yourself past your limit, but also be smart about it, right? Like don't burn out. But um, when it's something super hard and you're trying to learn, take the time to learn it. Go, I don't want to say go past your limit, but you do have to push yourself at some part because you don't want to um, become lazy or complacent. And that's basically what I'm doing, right? Like I'm trying to stay disciplined, if that makes sense. So I'm pushing myself to stay disciplined, but I'm not pushing myself in a way to where I get burned out. And so that's something that I want to very much so um, deliver towards the end of this vlog hopefully i articulated that well hopefully you all enjoyed watching me in my first week of law school today is the second week of law school today's tuesday so yesterday marked the second week and you guys will probably see this on the mark of my third week because i'm really and truly trying to kind of um put my you know have my crafts as well and so i've also learned that you know thursdays have to be my off day like it has to be because that's the last day of class class ends at 7 50. um what else is in there and there's nothing afterwards i just have a free day to me so i think that's the day that i'm gonna work on my craft because i absolutely need like a break like i said right so just being honest with myself i will not retain anything if i don't keep myself accountable and give myself breaks so with that being said, I hope you guys are willing to follow me on this journey. I feel like my next videos are going to be largely law based because that's just where I'm at right now. So with that being said, I'm going to try to produce different content. I have saved videos that I just haven't uploaded because they need a final editing. But, um, you know, there's going to be different content in here, probably just not as often. So thank you guys for joining me today. If you're interested in following me on my journey, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on your post notifications so you never miss when I post a new video. Also, follow me on all my social medias because that's really where I'd be active. So that's going to pop up on the screen or I'm just going to let you guys know it's Whitney's underscore script. Again, um, if you guys are interested to know how I study, if you guys are interested to know about the cases that we're discussing, I can give a little brief and that can help me study, right? So um, with that being said, thank you guys for joining me today and I hope to see you next time.